All right, guys. Whoop. Hold on. Let's get out of here. Yeah, let's continue without saving. Menus are a little weird to navigate in this game. A little bit different from normal button combinations I'm used to. Let's go up here. I think we can get this one. Yeah, the gate itself is all rotten, but the handle might work. Okay, then. Let's give this a go. All right, so we have a normal ring. Press X button at the right time so that all so that you hit all three ring area hit all three hit areas. It's a weird sentence. So that you hit all three hit areas of the normal ring. Hit three times or you fail. Oh. So I think they intentionally make this difficult because there's kind of a funny banter here. Hmm. This thing's pretty tough. Try it again. I'll do it this time. <laughs> Leave it to me. So I just want to miss it that time on purpose. Try again. Try again. <laughs> this fucking handle. Urgh. It moves a little bit slower than the one I'm used to in combat. Whew, finally got it off. I suppose we can continue now. Yep, I guess so. You've received sluice gate handle. All one word, apparently. One handle is enough. We've got the handle, we gotta go over here and block the exit, but not without fighting first. So one thing, for those that aren't familiar, when I like to do RPGs is we start to encounter some of the same fights, I'll begin to cut out some of those fights. So that you guys will see all of the enemies at least one time, so we don't get into these repetitive motions of seeing the same fights over and over and over again. But usually in the beginning, I'll keep a lot of the fights in so you guys can get a feel for the combat and enjoy the experience a little more. We're gonna need to do some healing. Let's go into options real quick. We're gonna go into special skills. So we can use our cure ability. All right, we have completely recovered. Completely recovered. It even shows you the Judgment Ring, too, for which you would have to deal with in combat if you were casting the ability. There are also some upgrades that will increase the range of the Judgment Ring, which we will find not too long from now. Okay, perfect. A little rusty, but I can't ain't complaining. That seems to have done the trick. Looks like it'll take a while for the water to drain. Hey, I see we take a rest over there. R right. Back to the save point! She's asleep. What's that all about? She's got some nerve. Yeah, to hell with it. I'm just gonna... Uh. Father. Whoa. You talking in your sleep? Don't scare me like that. Boy. Why am I stuck protecting this damn girl? Oh, please. Don't tell me she's dreaming about her dad. I'm getting a bit sleepy myself. What the? This aura, it's... My god. Foxface. <laughs> At last we meet. Father? What, what are you doing here? I've come to visit, boy. 
The souls of the monsters you killed are quite lonely, you see. Souls of the monsters? What a lovely face. And yet, I must show proper courtesy. It is thanks to this woman's power that I am even here. Her power? What? Haven't you noticed? This world overflows with the ghosts of the monsters you've slain. The gate of eternal darkness was closed until now. You see, this woman is causing it to open. The ghosts sealed inside the dark, darkest depths of your heart. They call to me, boy. And they demand that I devour your very soul. Okay, now we're getting into some Kingdom Hearts dialogue. Stay away! Great, my dad can teleport. Stay away! It's combat time! Mike Tyson's punch-out style against father. Wearing a fox mask. Ow. You actually see his face there, too. The mask, for some reason, disappears during punches. I'm pretty sure this is another one of those fights we can't actually win. So yeah, it reduces us down to one hit point, which is why I say it's probably one of those fights you're not really intended to win. So I'm not going to waste any healing items. Death Emperor! So if we use that ability I was talking about earlier, this is what we would turn into. I know I didn't show that to you guys yet, but I will. I'm saving it for the right time. So we have that exact same ability that he just used on us. Where are we now? Ugh. What's going on? Where am I? This is just like in my dreams. Huh? Where's... Where is he? <laughs> so he didn't come with me, eh? Damn. I can't believe this. Honestly, this is a pretty lame illusion. If it is an illusion. Yep, this is it, alright. The graveyard from my dreams. Aw, oh, man. I don't want to be remembering this. Now's the part where I get lost, then wake up in a cold sweat just as the monster is about to eat me. No, no, no! Nothing but trouble ever since that freaking voice showed up. Maybe I've lost it completely. First, Dad jumps out of my nightmare and shows up right before my eyes, and now I'm in the dream. I save that girl and don't get so much as a smile. Come on, aren't they supposed to get all dewy-eyed? Dewy -eyed? Oh, Mr. Yuri, thank you so much, Smooch. Ain't that how it's supposed to go? Oh man, now I'm all depressed. Let's have a look at this tombstone, because it's glowing. Ugh. Aren't these tombstone thingies freaky? Almost like they're alive. <laughs> wouldn't it be hilarious if all the monsters I've killed started crawling out of these? <laughs> no, it wouldn't be. This one's glowing. Seal of Earth, huh. What? I oh, spoke too soon. All the monsters you've killed are now crawling out of the tombstones. Good going, Yuri. You jackass. Boom! Ooh. 
The Moon Howl! Punch him in the face! Goodbye, sir. Not sure I would want to get that close to that creature. Seems like it could really mess me up. But not Yuri. No, not Yuri. He doesn't care. CQC. I learned these moves back on Mother Base. Putting up a barrier, I see. Physical barrier power, 15% up. Oh, CQC, I broke my knife. All right. I think we've acquired the Kenyan mangrove, cr mangrove crab ability. Actually, this is the soul of time. Raging tiger? I think that's what it said. Flashed that a little too quick. <laughs> yeah, I knew you'd show up. But it didn't quite go as planned, eh? Huh? What the? Suddenly I feel awful. Don't pass out on me, Yuri. Hold it together. Violent impulse swells up inside you. You've received the soul of Tigerian. A new spirit to fuse with. Is this my power? Equipping of souls. If you do not equip a soul that you have received, you cannot undergo fusion. At the menu, equip the soul you received in a soul slot. Be sure not to forget. All right, so let's go ahead and equip that. So we can go, I really like this option here, the strongest, it will automatically equip the best gear onto your character so you don't have to do it yourself. I like that function quite a bit. Let's go in here to soul. So we've got death emperor equip, but we can also equip raging tiger. Where is hidden dragon? No, that was crouching tiger. Wrong thing. Let's see. Sometimes I like to poke around, see what kind of loot there is. There's nothing that actually indicates where the loot is, so you just kind of have to look. The seal of light is carved here. The seal of wind. So I'm assuming when we come back here, we'll be able to get more abilities as time goes on. That door. Now I see. So it was you all along pulling the strings, eh? We are pleased to see you, boy. The detestable young Harmonixer who damned us to the eternal hell. <laughs> no need to thank me. But to be honest, I really haven't missed you guys at all. <laughs> your pathetic vibrato. Bravado. Can't hide your fear. Keep laughing. I'll slice that stupid mask in two with my fist. <laughs> your mind may not comprehend this place, but your heart understands it full well. Yes, this world is a reflection of your own mind's darkness. Darkness you have created yourself. Ho ho ho, the more of our brethren roaming about the world you strike down, the more you shall become saturated with venomous malice, born of their bitter vengeance. And when the limit is past, so shall then so then shall he be reborn into the world of the living. Ho ho ho, the man, the very thought of whom makes you shrink in terror. Enough, shut your stinking mask face. That's enough. You think I'm scared? Don't make me laugh. I've been hunting monsters for over 10 years. I can handle one or two of those guys with the flick of a finger. You got that, you bodiless freaks? <laughs> Don't get so excited. You loved your father so much that now you're wandering aimlessly in search of him. Stay out of this, look. I'm just down for revenge for my parents. It's none of your concern. Heh. <laughs> Strange words for someone who still desperately wants to believe his father is alive somewhere. You. 
Now you're really starting to piss me off. Say another word and I'll smash your smirking faces in. <laughs> Slow down, boy. Worry not. We have a proper uh, opponent for you. Sweep away the acclamation of malice. You must do battle. So malice, that's a pretty interesting game mechanic. Apparently as we fight monsters in the world, we accumulate malice and we have to come back here in order to remove it. Otherwise, bad things happen. So there are consequences to getting into fights, is my understanding. Though so I haven't really gotten far enough into the game for it to matter, so... We'll see how that goes. Optimum. Easy enough. Ha! Come on, at least give me some sort of challenge. What's next, you guys? <laughs> well done. Your victory has swept aside the vengeance of our brethren. And it appears that the reactions of that cursed talisman you hold have vanished as well. <laughs> it's too early to get cocky, boy. This purification is only temporary. What's that supposed to mean? Ho ho ho. When you return to your world, killing our com compatriots? It's a weird word. Killing our... Ooh, excuse me. Killing our compatriots will only result in increased malice. Then you will come back here to lower it. No matter how many you slaughter, this hell will continue. <laughs> then, in due time, he will be resurrected. The man you fear more than death itself. <laughs> Do you intend to keep running forever? <laughs> how much easier it would be if you, you'd simply come here in death. Enough. Shut up. <laughs> Be gone with you, boy. Return to the world of the living. Maybe I will. See you later. Ease. Wait. Up. Huh? That voice. Yuri, please open your eyes. Ah, my head again. Wake up. Wake up, please. Yuri, please, open your eyes. So, he's back. Are you alright? You were having a nightmare, mumbling about masks and malice. None of your business. My head's really starting to hurt, that's all. Phew. How long was I out? Only two or three minutes since I found you, but you seemed in such pain. Nothing to worry about. I always have nightmares, ever since I was a kid. Come on, let's go. Alright, interesting turn of events there. We duped it out with Father. And uh, we also went to the graveyard. We were introduced to an yet another game mechanic. Snag a save. <laughs>